Hello everyone, welcome back to another exciting episode of Cousins Outdoors. Today I will be sharing with you how I make my venison roast. It is a, a delicious roast that I made about a week ago. It is absolutely amazing. I hope you guys will try this out because you're going to love this. Okay, step one, obviously, take your venison out. I already had this pre-cut into the, some chunks here, some nice round chunks, not round, some roast chunks here, some meat, chunks of meat right there. I put one big slab in there. I got another big slab right here, put in there. Then what I'm going to do here is uh, open up a bottle. Barbecue. Open this bad boy on up. What you're gonna want to do is put the whole bottle in. Gonna squeeze it all on out in here. Just put the whole thing in there. Oh, lost the cover. We'll figure. Okay. Anywho. You want to put that whole bottle up in there. Yummy. And then what you're going to do is uh, come over here, grab some old fashioned root beer. You're going to, usually, I, but you're supposed to buy a bottle of root beer, you know, and just put the whole bottle in. Yeah, I bought the liter because I'm just a cheapskate. So what you're just going to do is you're just going to fill this thing on up with root beer until you're about almost, almost full. Almost past your meat there. Just a little bit in there. So then what I'm going to do is, oh, can I fill all that? Okay. I'm going to grab some mushrooms as well. I'll put a can of mushrooms in there. Juice it all. Just get them all up in there. Okay. Now what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to cover this bad boy. You're going to want to put it on low and you're going to let it sit for about eight hours or so. And I will catch back with you guys in exactly eight hours. Just got done with this. This uh, it's been sitting for eight hours now. It is nice and hot and ready to be taken out here. What you want to do now is take take your roast out, get it on over here to the side. What you want to do now is you want to come over here and you just want to tear it apart. Actually, while I'm doing this, now that you had it all taken out, you're actually supposed to take uh, some cornstarch here. Take about uh, two tablespoons cornstarch. Put it all in there. Mix it up nice and good. It thickens it up a little bit. So it's nice. Nice texture when it comes on out. Back to four. There you go. Now, after you got it all shredded up nice. Now go ahead, take it off, put it back in your pot here.
Get all that soaked in there nicely. Soaked on in there. Perfect. Then you want to do, you want to cover this bad boy back up. You're going to want to turn this thing on the high. And you're going to let it sit for another 20 minutes. So we'll see you in another 20 minutes. Welcome back folks. Okay, just got it back. Let it sit for that 15 minutes. Well, I can't wait to bite into this. My bum. Get in there. Just do it like a full pork. You know? Put it right on that bun. Doesn't that just look delicious? Right there. Make sure you go like and subscribe to our YouTube channel for some more great content. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.